Joining me now for tonight's Retaking America segment is Mark Bronovich. He's the Arizona Attorney General and a United States Senate candidate. Uh, Mr. Attorney General, thanks for, for joining us. It, it is amazing how an election is just months away and suddenly uh, these Democrats are getting a backbone and saying, oh, we got a problem. But, you know, they weren't there before, were they? No, they weren't. And that's the reason why uh, I've been leading lawsuits against the, the Biden administration and their failure to secure the border and all the lawlessness and the danger it's created our communities. The reality is, and you know this, Jason, there is a political class in Washington, D.C. that will say or do anything to get elected. And it's the reason why we need responsible people in D.C. representing American values. And the reality is Joe Biden and Cartel Kelly are trying to impose some neo-Marxist vision on this country, and Americans are paying the price, not only at the gas pump, at the grocery store, but literally with our lives and the lives of our children. And it is a dangerous experiment that they are trying to impose. And I think that there's this political conversion with some Democrats nowadays, but, but shame on them. They have enabled Joe Biden to basically destroy our country in just a year and a half. Tell us about this temporary restraining order that uh, you're attempting to put in place, the suit that you put in place uh, to try to get the administration to do what it's supposed to do. Yeah. You know, Jason, you just mentioned a tsunami um, is coming to America, and it is. If uh, Title 42 is lifted, there will be a tidal wave crashing on our shores, but it's not anything to do with climate change or what Joe Biden was talking about today in Seattle, it has everything to do with the man-made disaster that Biden has done. So when he stopped building the border wall, when he stopped deporting people with deportation orders, when he tried to lift the Remain in Mexico policy, now the last thing that we have in place that's saving us from even more illegal immigration, even more crime and drugs flowing into our country is Title 42. So I have led a coalition. We've got uh, 20 AGs involved. We have a hearing Monday in Louisiana. Louisiana, and we're hoping to get a federal judge to say to the Biden administration, no, stop, you can't do this because American lives are at risk because of Cartel Kelly and Joe Biden wanting to enable the cartels instead of protecting American taxpayers. It is truly stunning that the president of the United States in all his time, 50 years, being the president, the vice president, in all his time in, in the United States Senate has never been to the United States border with Mexico. Unbelievable. Mr. Attorney General, thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you, Jim.